What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back to the medium. We're ready to head on into this place and see if the game picks up. Uh, so I will say, after episode one, it was it was definitely one of the slower episode ones I've seen in a in a long time. But I've heard good things about this. Tight. I needed to find another way in. Like the review scores looked good. Anyone I've been home? Hearing chatter from friends. Or anything? Niwa says hello. What the? Hello, Thomas? Bro, that is not Thomas. That is definitely that is either a zombie or somebody with a really, really bad case of Alzheimer's. I feel like I should be able to jump through that. You want to keep me out, Neva? They're going to have to do better than that. Alzheimer's man's gone. Not a whole lot of people knew about Neva. It used to be a oh, government vacation resort. Until one day it just stopped. And so an urban legend was born. The Neva Massacre. The details were always fuzzy. Crazed workers, ancient curses. You know, the usual. More of a shuffle than a run. Like they they ended. Oh, there we go. So I can just run on ahead and I'll probably see, yeah. What's this? E&K, 1968. Mm -hmm. Come on. Let me... It's on the back side of the tree? I can see it. I can't get to it. Whatever. It's probably just another hand mark. We'll just keep going. Recently unearthed remains renovation works have been suspended. An archaeological examination. Something happened here. Well yeah, there was an archaeological examination. Like I stopped to read, you should be also aware of this.
The split would come and go. If a place had a story to tell, well, I guess I was there to listen. X or A? What happens with A? Dead. Like everything else in this place. So, okay, so depending on when I hit X or A, it determines which I'm focusing on. Alright, that's a little, this is a little weird. The place felt old and soaked in misery. Figures, I guess. A thousand years of history doesn't just happen. It's kind of weird, because, like, I don't, I don't know, like, but even in which screen I want to look at. Darkness, light can linger. Lonely, fragile, waiting for someone to embrace it. As I absorbed the energy, I wondered who it was that left it behind. A dying soldier whispering the name of his beloved? Or maybe just glad to be done with this world? that energy does in any case I figured I could use it oh we're gonna like use the energy. energy right yeah charge a spirit blast oh so that worked good for you Marian these powers of mine spirit the blast as much of a pain in the ass as they were they did come in handy sometimes. I mean, so... There I was. Well, I'll let her talk first. Worlds, but never really living in either. Yeah, from what we're seeing so far, this doesn't seem like it's... I'm not going to bother with a webcam. Caution, fire hazard? This looks like it's... I mean, it's a forest. It seems more uh, puzzle-oriented than spooky. I mean, a lot of horror games have, have strong puzzle elements, but... Like, Resident Evil, I feel like when you get to your puzzle elements, it's like a nice break from the horror. Like, otherwise, it's like this, you know, it's this non-stop ride. And this so far... Oh. What happened to you? Seems more explory. But the deer's kind of weird. No, it's early. Give it a couple episodes to build up. I just know that first episode, man. That first episode was... Ooh. was not a strong start. In fact, it was the opposite of a strong start. It was very... Very kind of slow and going through the paces and... I feel like now that we're now that we're able to to run at least we're we're moving along a little bit quicker in this episode, but still still kind of like not much happening yet. That's my problem. Like I want to know like where does you know where is where is it getting to? Is this going to be a, the kind of game where we got to run away from things and hide? Are we going to be able to fight back at all? Is it strictly going to be like hide and puzzle or? You know. <gasps> Now it looks like something out of Mortal Shell. What the hell are you, Neva? The aura in that place. I've seen others like it, but never this intense. Well, some it's steps. Like a landfill of memories, emotions. And none of them good. I guess I'm supposed to just follow the footsteps. Welcome to Niwa. I'm here. No, there's definitely. 
definitely something. Trust me, you made the right call sending me. Yes, it's only a matter of time. Even the objects here had auras. Sounds like Mulder from X Files. Them, I could sense their stories, words, images, feelings left behind. Hello? Anybody in there? Locked. Obviously. There's gotta be another way. Butterflies. Well, I've already proven my prowess as a dumpster climber. Shit, the handle's missing. Maybe... I huh? kicked that shit open. Oh, hang on, I doubt I want to go all the way down there. I think I was going a little bit too fast and I skipped dialogue. She said the handle's missing, something, something. There's a broken window up there. Alright, so I gotta find the handle to get oh, the, uh... Find the handle to get the dumpster to climb up to the window to climb on in. I mean, so do I... Am I just exploring the parking lot? Looking... <laughs> looking for a door handle? What's that? I'm like seeing like a couple small things, the little, the white blips. Hey, old timer. Now, what's a fine machine like you doing in a place like this? Doubling as a spare bedroom, apparently. Hope you don't mind if I uh, pop your trunk. Not much here. Uh, minus the screwdriver. Although, this could be yeah. handy. Yeah, I'll use the screwdriver. I can probably shove that into the door. Ow! Shit! What the hell? This looks like it's a dead end. You know, I'm gonna be honest. It was it was good that y'all picked this as a series, cause as <laughs> as slow as it's going, if this was a stream, I don't think we would have made it past the first hour. I think we would have fallen asleep. But like, I want to give it a chance. It's the dry season. I got nothing else on deck. I've heard good things about it. I probably just gotta like power through a bit of it, and shit'll hit the fan. We need we need to believe. So it began the great dumpster heist of 1999. I'm starting to get tired of your shit, Neva. You better be worth it. I mean, you're basically breaking in. All based around a mysterious phone call. That's the thing. We get we get so many spam phone calls these days. If I opened the phone and and I heard some of the shit she heard, I would have been like, "Eat my dick!" and hung up right then and there. I got one the other day. It was like, "This is a blah 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 message," and informing you that you have been uh, named as a as a defendant in a blah 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 lawsuit. It is in your best interest to. 
to call this number. If you do not call us back, we you may get fucked legally. And I'm like, wow, that is some... Because, you know, I mean, like, I'm not going to fall for that shit. You know, I hear that then, and then my, I, I hang up immediately, and I block the number. <laughs> because, first off, anytime you're served something legally, they can't give you a fucking phone call. You would have to be served papers. You would have to... A, a, uh, someone from the sheriff's office would have to come down to your address and give you a piece of paper that says, hey, asshole, this person's suing you. you. You can't just get a fucking phone call. Same with taxes. If you ever get, you know, a thing where it's like, we represent the IRS and we are calling you. It's bullshit. Hang up. So it's true. I need to find this Thomas guy and get... Um, but yeah, man, lately it's just like, so, so many spam phone calls. And the thing is like, as, as a, you know, somebody that's, that's, you know, hello, kind of grown through this. Anyone? Um, you know, Thomas? I, I remember seeing like the rise of the you internet. You there? I mean, I'm not even that old, you know, I'm 33, but I remember growing up when like, you know, it was still 56 K you had to, you know, you couldn't, you couldn't be on the internet if your parents were on the phone at the same time. Shit was nuts. But the thing is, like, people like my grandma and grandpa, if they got a phone call that said they were named as, like, a, a plaintiff in a suit and they were going to get sued, they'd probably fucking fall for that shit. It's crazy, man. And, like, nothing is done about it. Like, all these scumbag companies need to be, like, fucking buried. Bankrupt them, take them for everything they're worth. Throw the people in jail. Why do my teeth fall out? Back to school, puzzles and crosswords and much more. Ugh. So you are here. We got the day room, lobby, reception, pool, sauna, day room. Anyway, point is it's fun discussing bullshit. It, it keeps it, it keeps us on our toes, which is necessary with how, how slow the game's moving. Um, so I got some names. Where's my Elfin? Sinners be damned. Vote for Pedro. Anything back here? They said it was a government owned resort, but like this place is not laid out like a resort. It's laid out like the type of place you'd like deposit your deposit your parents. Like a fancy care facility, basically. I suppose it's hard to, to see with everything fucked up looking like this, but in the lobby it's kind of like eh. a lot of mirrors very tacky Niwa This is the smoking area of the hotel. Just stay over here, please. <gasps> Hello? Thomas? Easy, Marianne. Yeah, think, why is she like it's not? Just a good old fashioned haunted hotel. Like, why would Call you not come here with like something? You know, a firearm, baseball bat, fucking bear mace. Walking around this spooky ass place all by yourself. I have to turn down effects a little bit lower. 
Like, I know I got my headset pretty low. That shit's loud as hell. You startled me. I did, didn't I? You look real scared. I'm sadness. Marianne. Yo, she has no kneecaps. It's just threads of ligaments and shit. Is that your name? I mean, you seem pretty cheerful to me. Well, it's what well, I. Her remember. arms decaying too. Um, my friends used to call me by a different name, but well, I don't remember what it was. Your friends. Oh yeah, I used to have a lot of friends here. Something happened to them? Mm, uh, well, uh, I, I don't really want to talk about it. That, that's okay. So, do you live here? All by yourself? <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't believe how boring it gets sometimes. I can imagine. This place must have been... Oh, yes. So busy. People coming and going all the time. <laughs> Always someone to play with. Must have been nice. It was. Not anymore. So, tell me, what happened? Uh, I, I remember. People stopped coming. Only a few of them stayed. But they became very sad. Very angry. They might hurt you. <laughs> Thanks. But I can take care of myself. Yeah, we got spirit blasts. I was wondering, have you seen... Mary Ann? <laughs> yes. Well, would you play with me? Just for a little while. It, it, it's been so long since I played with anyone. Oh, okay, okay. But I need your help first. Yes. Uh, yes! Uh, anything, Mary I'm looking Anne. for a man. Thomas. Do you know him? Uh, let me think. Uh, I've heard that name before. Uh, so Take your time. The second floor. We can look there. Come on. Hurry, oh, Wait. Marianne. I can't go that way. Damn. I need to get up there somehow. So I guess even though in the... Even though in the second world there's a ladder... Okay, so there's, there's a thing here. The shadow, shadow realm that's blocking her. Alright, well, having met Sadness, it seems like this is a, a pretty natural spot to, to wrap up again. Um, I don't know, maybe it's picking up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna remain hopeful. I mean, to be, to be honest, like, even if I stopped, what am I gonna play? I know someone's gonna be like, just go play more Dark Souls, bro. Like, no, I don't wanna play more fucking Dark Souls. It's like a million hours of Dark Souls on my channel. I want, I want something else. I want something fresh and new. Like Neo 3. Or a new monster hunter. Or something. I don't know. Anyway, stay tuned. Um, not sure how fast we're going to bang this game out. I might have another episode later. I might just do one episode a day. I'm not in any rush here, to be honest. So, anyway. Stay tuned. Catch y'all soon. Peace.